All right, I'd like to just give another update on how the terraquaponic system is doing. What we've done is we've built a framework over our vegetable growth area, um, and that's trying to do really well. We'll just go a bit closer in. Currently, we've got a lot of tomatoes going, a lot of, a lot of climbing beans, some basil, um, some comfrey. We've got some hops and we've got some cucurbitures going as well. We also have, if you look down there, you can see where our siphon system is. We have a lot of cresses going and we will be adding a lot more three dimensions to the system. What we've also introducing now is rice. And if you look over at the far paddy over there, you see that we've drained it. We started planting some rice in there. The rice we're using, we've searched for a very long time and we've found some wild African rice, which is extremely hard to find now. Um, Sativa Bartii, as opposed to the, uh, I beg your pardon, the Ariza Bartii, as opposed to the Ariza Sativa, which is your Chinese rice, and which has really been genetically uh, fiddled with. This rice is very pure. It comes from a clan in South Senegal and we're very excited to have it. So that's going in there. We've also had some of it growing in the top where we have our grow beds as well as some vegetables. A great assortment which are doing really well there amongst the fig trees. And in this pond over here, which we will be planting the rice in, uh, which is in the grow beds, has our growers, uh, Mozambique tilapia growers in. They're currently averaging at about 75 grams each. 75 to 80, we do have a couple over 100 grams. That water, as you know, as my last goes underneath, comes through the filter here, and then moves down to where we have the fingerlings. They're roughly about 35 to 40 grams now. And in the little net over there, we have all our fry, which are all less than, less than 10 grams. Starting to establish another garden, you can see down there, which is starting to do really well. Uh, it's got a lot of strawberries, a lot of sweet potatoes, lettuce, tomatoes, there's a lot of amaranth in there as well, uh, and cucumbers. Down below that, where that water goes into, we'll be planting some more rice, and we have some floating islands, which have also got rice in them. If we're trying that as well, we also have another system where we're trying to sprout them. In the garden just below that, next to that, you can see we have some potatoes going in there, as well as all sorts of other vegetables. So that's all coming pretty good. Um, and yeah, and the other thing, just moving back here, you can see in our walls we started planting uh, geraniums and strawberries which are doing really well. So thanks for following and we'll catch up again soon. Bye now.